Good morning, everyone. My name is Lua Shegun, and this is Lua's News. Our e-learning portal continues to expand, and students share their experiences with us. So we have had online school for seven weeks now, and I'll admit that in the beginning it was tough, and I had my doubts, but now I've been able to adapt by knowing when and where to do things. Secondly, about the extracurricular activities. OIS has numerous extracurriculars that cannot be done by Zoom calls, but we have been able to squeeze in some like Monday assembly, Wednesday morning sports and performing arts meeting, Friday services for Islamic students, and Sunday for Christian students. Lastly, on the sixth week of this program, we observed our meeting break, and it also fell on Democracy and Children's Day. It gave us a well-earned break, even though we had projects to do. Thank you very much. Stay safe. The OIS online learning platform started five weeks ago with two subjects. Since it was a success, we went up to six subjects. Post school assembly, money sport activities, and religious services were also introduced. I particularly like the money sports segment because all my family members we take part in it and it actually makes it very fun. After I get home from bed, I attend to my chores, freshen up, and then get to class. When I'm done with my classes, my mom gives me quizzes to refresh my memory. On my personal leisure time, I'm either drawing or learning new dishes, playing video games, or playing football. I've also been developing a new comic book, and I've also jotted down some ideas in my journal. And at the end of this lockdown, I hope I'll be able to publish my first comic book. Hello everyone, I'm here to enlighten you guys more about Talk To You All and how I have been keeping up with these active online classes. To be brief, this online lessons to me is an amazing, it's very amazing because it is very effective. We have been able to solve the math problems or tasks given to us in half the time and I have learned a lot that I must actually prefer to have at school. Online classes are the classes that we have during this time while at home. It makes us forget that we're not meant to be relaxing but we're meant to be reading. The on, do you using the Zoom classes? We get to see our teachers one on one and we get to explain what is shown on the eleven platform. I'm going to talk about the midterm break. The midterm break was fun but short. Since we're at home, we get to do whatever we want. And this midterm break was just the time when we did learn. I'm going to talk about the extracurricular activities. The extracurricular activities have been fun so far. Even though we don't get to see our peers, it's still interesting. The public speaking has been really fun and really competitive. I think these online classes have been like very, very effective because that made us closer to our teachers by giving us all these tasks that we're not able to do in school and we do it half the time, mostly without cheating. And I want to say congrats to OIS for this platform. And we can announce a big thank you to everybody there, all the teachers there that are trying to do their best to give us the work we deserve to do, and all the students trying to do the work. And I want to just say thank you. The e learning has been good for me and a lot of other students. Although we all face challenges, it has all been resolved. The midterm break was also good because I had time to relax and take my mind off schoolwork. We've also had other extracurricular activities such as public speaking, the services on Sundays and Fridays, morning sports, and so on. Six year 12 students are taking part in the 2020 Breakthrough Junior Challenge, a World War Khan Academy Partnered Science Video Challenge for students between 13 and 18 years old. The competition gives students an opportunity to make three minute video on any science or mathematics related topic of their choice or on the COVID 19 pandemic. The other students taking part in the challenge are Jomloju to Diola Dipo, whose topic is the world and coronavirus. Chidera Lalire's topic is emotions. Daniel Dari has chosen virology. Uluwa Kemi thermodynamic entropy. Jennifer Grigbe Baje, vision and Latifa Mutiu, time dilation. As part of the selection process, the public will be asked to vote. The voting links and process will be shared when we get to that stage. 
Russian International School students qualified for the semi-final of the Global Social Leaders Global Goals competition. Russian students entered the competition through their youth empowerment initiative, which was tagged healing every living person. Help. No fewer than 60 youths from the local communities benefited in the SKUs acquisition program, which lasted for four weeks. The Russian Help project was showcased during the Virtual Global Social Leaders Festival on the 18th of June 2020. Russia International School, in collaboration with the Mentally Aware Nigerian Initiative Money, organized the COVID-19 mental wellness training for all staff, students and parents. The virtual training took place between Wednesday and Saturday afternoon on Zoom. According to the school doctor Alexander Adeyemi, the training was necessary to promote mental health awareness among students, staff and parents during this COVID-19 pandemic. The weekly online fitness sessions have been an exciting experience for students staff and parents. An online survey was sent out in order to get feedback from parents and students on possible ways to improve the program. Students' involvement in forms of video presentation is being considered to be virtually shown to the participants. Awards of merit point and principal's recommendations are already in place as a form of motivation. This is a reminder that the best way to protect yourself from COVID-19 is to stay at home, keep your social distance and practice good hygiene. Keep exercising daily and eat with a well-balanced diet. The admission process into Year 7, Year 8, Year 9 and Year 10 in Russian International School is in progress. Parents can obtain the application form on the school's website. Arrangements are in place for candidates to take their entrance examination remotely. That is the news. Thanks for watching. Stay safe.